Jesse, take a second and just reflect back on everything that's going on your senior year. You know, senior years, a lot of things going on. It's exciting. Specifically in, in the sports world, what are you just going to stick out to you the most? Um, I think just the relationships I've built with my teammates. I mean, I played, I ran track in the indoor season and then outdoor I do both. So I dual sport with track and lacrosse and just being with those guys every day, five days, six days a week, all hours of the day. I mean, you see them in school, it's it's a blast. Mm -hmm. and I think building relationships with those guys and then even with my coaches, like Duffy, Andrew Duffy was the offensive coordinator. He's like my older brother at this point. Like I've been with him for four years. Mm -hmm. He's watched me grow, helped me with everything and couldn't be more thankful for those guys. That's awesome. Uh, take a second and talk about the South Carroll game Cup from a couple weeks ago in the playoffs. You know, a team that you guys lost to in the regular season. What did it mean to be able to see them again and knock them off for a regional title for your second in two years? Yeah, that was huge. I mean, South Carroll's a team that cross town rival it's 15 minutes away all those guys I mean we grew up together but it's like there's a little bit of animosity there so it's it's huge to beat them especially after losing in the regular season coming back for a regional championship two years in a row is it's unmatched I mean you can't you can't beat that mm -hmm. you just mentioned it a couple minutes ago talking about running track um, comparing the two is there any overlap in preparation that may benefit you on the field for either track or lacrosse yeah absolutely I mean I ran indoor my sophomore year because I wanted to get better at lacrosse I think just the overall athleticism and like knowing how to run is something a lot of athletes don't really understand like mm -hmm. learning how to run is There's huge yeah, absolutely. like you, I mean I got so much faster over the last few years and I think that translated on the field just my overall confidence mm -hmm. running past my defenders and like being able to break them down and see what their weaknesses are in their running was huge and I think it helped me a lot. Mm -hmm. Last question, uh, at the end of the day, you look back on it 15, 20, 25 years from now, what are you gonna remember most about these, these four years playing high school sports? Oh gosh, wow. Um, I think the little moments, like I've always been huge on practice is the most fun for me. Like, cause you see everyone, everyone's personality comes out the most in mm -hmm. practice cause mm -hmm. it's after school, everyone's like done. It's like, yeah. we're just here to get better and everyone's personalities comes out and I think lacrosse is huge with that because it's such a creative sport mm -hmm. and you can see everyone's personality in their game so I think the practices every day after school just coming out relaxing with the guys yeah. and then seeing the coaches and all that stuff is I'll never forget it that's awesome uh Jesse I appreciate you for taking time to talk to me it's Jesse Jason the 2022 CM Sportsnet boys lacrosse player of the year Thank you. want more local sports coverage be sure to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel